Have a cool idea for an art piece, but not sure how to tackle it? Don't worry, we've got some handy little tricks to turn regular ideas into true masterpieces! Now let's get those creative juices flowing! Hmm, my crush has me feeling inspired! I sure hope he appreciates this! Here goes nothing! Uh, what's up, David? Nice. What she write to me? Yep, I've got some feelings about this. <laughs> Be still, my heart. Let's see here. Gah! My books! Sorry. Let me help you with those. Oh. So soft. Uh-huh. Wow. Um, my books? Oh, right. So… Yeah. Thank you. I think I'm in love. Wait. Just one last look. Yep. This guy is really something. Ah. Uh, oh, that's what I'll say. Nothing like reminding your sweetie about the moment you first laid eyes on each other. The hard part's over. Nice. Wow. I remember! Such a sweetheart! Love you, baby. I heard there's a special place where all magical beings roam free! Wouldn't you die to meet a real-life unicorn? Is the sky blue? Shall we? Look at all the colors! And that magical horn! What's going on? Whoa! Hey! Where are we? And look at these outfits! Pretty and pink for sure! Blue raspberry is my jam! Madison! Look! Wow. You're looking at me, girl. Don't you love my sparkles? You'll love this challenge even more! Ready to draw? We were born ready! First up in our drawing challenge… Meow! We love cats! They're simply the cutest! <coughs> Girls, we're drawing, remember? Should I make mine a tabby? Sit still, okay, little guy? Is this even accurate? Now we're talking. I want my proportions to be right. It's still not right. These can work. Just need a pinch of fur. Good thing I'm wearing goggles. Let me look at my calculations. Yep, just as I thought. What's Annie doing over there? The results are in. It's what I suspected all along. No more science. It's time to get artsy in here. Time's up already? Show us what you got, girls! Don't be shy. Very nice, Madison! Could you please? That is really good! I'll show you how to do it. You'll see that every day. Start with the word cat. Then build off the letters. You can add colorful details, too. Don't forget his little face. And some stripes look good, too! They kinda look alike, don't they? Ready for the next challenge? A cactus? You're going down! I doubt it. You are. Go! 
Whoa! This should be easy. Gotta keep my energy up. Feel no stress. You're one with the pen! I nearly finished! Done at last! Phew! Spot the difference. It's hard, isn't it? What is that? Watch and learn. I'll drag the sponge down the paper. Then use smaller sponge for the limbs. Now for the flowers. All I need to do is add some details. I might frame this afterwards. What do you think? Well, they're both green. Don't give up the day job. This isn't even gonna be a contest. Wow! A cactus pinata! Think there's candy inside? Only one way to find out! I'll put on this blindfold. Okay, time to work out some tension. It's glorious! Look! Huh? Did you say something? Where did she go? Hello? <laughs> Meh. Her loss. What happened? <gasps> hey! Where did this candy come from? Let go! What is this? Huggy Wuggy is mine! Uh-oh! Oh. Sup. I want you to draw Huggy Wuggy and Kissy Missy. Okay. No problem. I have an idea. Oh, Cheryl! Catch! Hey! That's not fair! <laughs> that's not my problem, is it, Huggy Wuggy? Okay, let's get started. I'll draw the eyes first. This should be pretty simple. It's just black circles. And now for the mouth. Now I'll fill it in with black plastic. Okay, that was easy. I'll draw his lips now. It's just a case of going around the mouth. Huggy Wuggy isn't so scary. Time for his fur. This might take some time. There's a lot of blue fur. I'll just draw some lines and work my way down. And join everything up. Then add some details. I think that's pretty accurate. Oh, I'm back! What? You're finished? Oh, I better hurry up! Don't panic. You can do this. I'll start with the mouth. That reminds me, I should buy some lipstick. And now for some teeth. Kissy Missy needs to see a dentist. So far so good. I'll fill in the mouth. This is tricky. Some white for the eyes. I need a steady hand. And now I can do the fur. This should be the easy part. It's just a case of filling it in. I'm almost finished. I just need to wait until it's cooked. It's time to flip it! I think it's ready! I did it! <laughs> That's the stuff of nightmares, Cheryl. Well done. The winner is Essie. Yes! I won! Ugh! Prepping for your art project is all part of the process. A messy one at that. Anyway, time to turn this idea into art. First stroke is always the best. Add a little bit of blue here. It's really coming together. Or is it? This is terrible! Nope. Good thing I have lots more paper. Ooh, smooth. This is worse than the first one! Ugh! Come on now, focus! You've gotta be kidding me. Why can't I paint a stupid flower? All right. Stay calm. Deep breath in. I can do this. I am fully capable. It's go time. Easy. Easy. Shoo! Huh? That was unfortunate. But wait a minute. What an interesting shape! I can work with this. Using your paintbrush in different ways can help you create entirely unique designs. 
and in my case, petals. Once you've gone all the way around, add some green for the leaves and stems. See how it's all coming together? Careful strokes go a long way. You can even attach these two. It fills out the space quite nicely. I knew I could do it! Whoa! You drew all this on your own? Why don't you have it, Annie? I've got more creating to do. And this time, I'm taking a whole new approach. But don't worry, we're still staying on theme here. See how these strokes make the leaves really come alive? Don't be afraid to take your time with these. You can even make grass, see? But the next part gets a little more complicated. I can use some puffy paints like these to create all new fun textures with a balloon! How satisfying was that? Now use it like a stamp. And you'll get these fun, totally unique flowers. Don't forget this one. Cool, right? Awesome! What do you think? <gasps> David! How did you even come up with that? My secret ingredient! Time for another spin! Hearts are our favorite! And we have the perfect models! One, two, three, go! So handsome! He has my heart all right! <gasps> That's my David! Your David? Well, this is awkward. Don't fight, girls! There's gotta be a way to settle this. Hello? You give me no other choice. And poof! Not so handsome anymore. Sorry, girls. He's mine! Huh? Has he always looked like this? What was I thinking? Ugh! His smile looks different. I hate to judge. Oh, right! Hey, Annie! Is that David? <gasps> I look okay? Where? Ha! Sucker! Don't see him? Where? <gasps> My markers are all gone! Madison, did you take them? Well, that wasn't very nice. Try to steal her stuff now! Is Madison frozen? Oh, these are mine! Thank you very much! We're drawing hearts, right? To make a perfect heart. Enclose it in a rectangle. And add stripes with a ruler. Then curved lines in the heart. You can use different colors. Outline the heart and make it nice and dark. Now make both sides match. Use white to make a sheen effect. My heart's finished and it's 3D! And unfreeze! But I didn't draw anything! This chair is incredible, Annie! So cool! Sorry about the theft. For me? Thank you! As long as I have David. Aw, this picture sure is cheery. Good enough to be framed. And why stop there? Just need some inspo. Mm-hmm. Right. You said what? Oh, Susan, you're bad! Ugh, I don't know. Um, excuse me? My paper! Oh, my bad. Oops. 
Look what you've done! It's ruined! Hey! Can I show you something? Ever hear of a happy accident? This is one of them. Whoa! Me? Yeah! You can do different sizes, too! Amazing! Let's do it! How many do you think can fit on here? As many as you want! Things are getting crazy! You can use pretty much anything! As long as it's circular, of course. You think we've done enough yet? It sure looks cool, doesn't it? Up high! My little artist! Okay, girls. Here we go! Now it's your turn. We're drawing hands, huh? Interesting. I have an idea. Check that out! What happened? Oh. Just a little electric surge. Is that shadow my hand? I just had the best idea ever! Now, that's better. And we have light, ladies and gents! Let's do it! First, trace your hand. Then turn your hand into an adorable little bird. Color him in with a white chalk pen. Don't color the wing just yet. Okay, now you can! And don't forget about those little feet! I don't know how to draw this thing! Huh? That looks stupid. Anything? I just don't see it! Ha! That's the one! Oof! My aim was a little off! Let's try this one! Trace your hand like this. Then turn it into a cute little doggy. Doesn't look like a hand anymore, right? Check out that giant tongue. Then give him brown fur. Time's up! Check these masterpieces out! Those were your hands! Incredible! And your deck is just fantastic! Truly remarkable! Perfect! How do I choose a winner? They're both so wonderful! Two judges for two deserving winners! So we both won this round? I've got a good feeling about this one! Well, that's disappointing. I thought this was a challenge. Okay, what should I use this time? Too big. Nah, I'm not feeling it. This is perfect. A pumpkin should be straightforward. It's an orange circle. I need to win this one. Okay, this'll do. I'll start with the sections, then the stem. Now to fill it in. A different shade and color will make it look good. I'm happy with that. What do you think? Hey, wake up! Hello? Yoo-hoo! Wake up! We're supposed to be drawing! I'm awake! What's going on? Oh right, the pumpkin. Great, time's up! This is the best I can do! You've got a little something on your cheek. Really? What? Aw, paint! It suits you! Yes! What surprise! Mmm! Pumpkin juice? This isn't nice. I… I feel funny. What's happening? Do 
Do I have a pumpkin for a head? Ah! At least you have a costume for next Halloween. <laughs> I hate this game! Ah! My face! My beautiful face! It's back! Oh, sorry, I got a fright. I'm never drinking this again. Hey, keep it over there. Okay, this spot looks substantial. Yeah? The trees, nature, what have you. The heat is on! You bet! I don't know… What? Hey, stop looking at mine! Whatever, fine. I'll be over here then. What can I paint? He's adorable! I hope David didn't see him. I saw it first! Uh-huh. May the best bird painter win! A few skillful circles can go a long way. Just have to know where to add the lines. Nice, right? But some color will really make it pop. Yellow is such a happy color, isn't it? It's perfect for such a cheerful guy. And how about some green? Such a peaceful hue. And add some blue for a real treat for the eyes. Doing the edges first is always best. It really rounds things out, doesn't it? Almost done. Just a couple of finishing touches. And that's how it's done, folks! A true masterpiece! Don't you agree? Yep, I'm pretty pleased. What is that? I just needed an extra hand. Turns out, a hand is all you really need. Well, that and a few strategically placed dots and lines. Can you see the bird face yet? Don't worry, it'll all come together soon. These branches ought to give it away. And here are its cute little feet. A little greenery? I think it's quite peaceful. Can you see the bird now? I'm just so creative, aren't I? Well, if you really want to see it… Not too shabby. Oh. I guess they're both pretty great. Should we ask the teacher? Seriously? I hope he's okay. Seems like he's just fast asleep. Hey! Ooh! All done, huh? Oh, great job. Now just give me, uh, five more minutes. Alrighty then. Hey, look! Wow! This is the best one yet! I need this to look amazing! First I'll draw a square. Then circles! I've got a better idea. Luckily I keep this photocopier handy. Okay, pop it. In you go. And press copy. I couldn't have done it any better. You get it on. That's it! I just need to color it now. Ooh, this will be fun. I'll put a line of red paint here. Now the rest. It's like a rainbow. It's just like a poppet. I want to press it. Good job. I think I might have won this one. No way! I did it! You've got to be kidding! Look at mine! Step away from the table, ma'am. Give me your hand. And the other one. Don't resist. Using a photocopier is not drawing. We take cheating very seriously here. Sorry? <laughs> you think you know someone. Wow! A chocolate poppet! My two favorite things! Delicious! 
Okay, you're going downtown. Come on. Uh-oh. Whatever. I need something that'll turn some heads. And I know just the thing. Complimentary hues for the win. But it's still missing something. But what? Ugh, this ball is so dinky. Whoa! That thing's blowing my mind! Mom! Oh, not now. Okay. You still have a lot of paint left. Which leaves room for me to play. Thank you. Ugh, I just don't know what to do. Okay, I'll try a little. Hey! Where did my paint palette go? David? Is that you? Ex Excuse me? Look! I did this! I call it pond water. Uh-huh. Oh, I know. You want to face paint? Give it a try, David. Whoa! Again! Fun, right? You can say that again! Yeah? What if I use my finger, too? Incoming! Ha! Blue dots coming in, people! But now for my favorite color! Woohoo! That's it! Look, mom! Well, isn't this incredible? But let's try one more trick. Symmetry can sure be beautiful! And to prove that to be true, you created it all on your own! It's a gorgeous butterfly! This line will really make it come to life, along with the outline of the wings. Other side! There! Just admire this pure beauty! And that's just the beginning, son! Okay, you ready for this one? Oh, let's see some giraffes! How do I do it? Oh, that's a piece of cake! I could do it in my sleep! I know! Start with a head like this! Now just a few more lines! I got it! Just a quick snack first! So fresh! Phew! That mall was huge! But I got the inspiration I needed! First, draw these four numbers. Look at this little guy! And here's a swan! A beautiful butterfly! And lastly, a fish! Now it's time to color them all in! He's cute, right? And this swan is super elegant! Don't forget the water! A pink butterfly? Adorable! It's all about the little details. Now onto the little fish! All right! Time's up, girls! I drew four animals! Including the giraffe, of course. Incredible, Madison! Annie? Just one more second, okay? I can't draw fast enough! Done! That's… interesting. What a sad excuse for a giraffe. Feel those creative juices flowing yet? Perhaps these hacks will get them going. Don't forget to share this video with your friends and subscribe to our channel for more awesome videos!